previously on Let's Play Football Manager 22, Sheffield Wednesday. Right, we've got Blackpool, Bristol Rovers or Liverpool. I wouldn't mind a Blackpool because Liverpool's there. Oh, we've got Bristol Rovers. That's probably one of the best ones to get. Bristol Rovers at home, okay. London as well. Dunkley, lovely. This game is a bit too close of what I wanted, but again, we're experimenting with some B-team players. Look at that, Cabernet and so, linked up together. Click through it, continue, continue, continue. Play, pick your team, tactics, and play for bloody game. Set new defensive record. Sheffield Wednesday, six games without conceding. Ooh, wait a sec. Hamstring, three to six weeks in for Carabao Cup. And I think by looking up the lineups, we both played a bit of that AB team. Good start, five minutes on clock. Canberry again. And this is where they bloody score. <laughs> saying 7.1 there, but... Ooh, have they just got a man sent off? Yep, okay, it's game over, surely. Something nice football, ah, oh, lovely. No, it's going to be one of them now. It's done a key at all, no? Ah. <laughs> I was going to say it's going to be one of them where it does a key highlight for four minutes and then the final whistle blows and it's just sitting there again. Good day, ladies and gentlemen, boys and girls. Welcome to episode eight of Let's Play Football Manager 22, Sheffield Wednesday. Hope you're all well. This video is an edited version from our stream that we do over on Twitch. Check out the link below. In today's episode, transfer window is now closed. Did we do any business? Our main goal scorer gets injured. Can another player jump in and produce for goals? And we continue our unbeaten run going into the fourth round of the cup. Right, let's jump right in. Transfer deadline passes. Um, obviously, we had no money, but plus for club in the summer in real life. Did quite a lot of business. I didn't want to do anything drastic. I kind of want to give them six months. Went to January and then make decision based. Then League One transfer window. So biggest spenders. Ipswich bought in 23 and they sold 23. So one in one out. But they also spent 2.7 million. Let's have a quick look. Um, transfer history. Yeah, Matt Penny. So they spent 2.7 million and they made half a million back. So 2.2 million. It's nice to see that some clubs have some money. He was their biggest sign-in. So Scott Frazier from MK Dons and George Edmondson from Rangers. And then Cameron Burgess from Accrington. And Vaclav Hedlerdke from Salford. And I think they're top, aren't they? It's which are they top? No, fourth. How is league tables looking? So five games played, we've got 10 points. One three, lost one, drawn one. Cholton are top of the table with AFC Wimbledon. Both haven't lost a game yet. I mean, look at that for August, right? That's a pretty good month. Can't argue at that. And then for English transfer roundup, oh, look at that, bigger spenders. Man City on 195 million. So who did we know about these, I would guess? Jack Grealish, oh yeah, 100 million, of course. Fabian. From Napoli, Fela Mendy. And you know what? Their left back, they was probably calling out for that type of player as well, where they got walk on the other side. Top deal, Lukaku, 98 million. We know about that one. Top deadline deal was Berardi. Went to Tottenham. So they're like, oh, he looks quite a good little player. Berardi, let's ring a bell. How are we financially? We've got £6 million in our bank. Made £3 million. Profit this month, total income merchandise is up, and monthly shirt sales is up. Good. All right, Plymouth away. League game. All right, we've got Bannon injured. Continue with our tactic. Seems to be okay. Only lost one so far. So Lewis Wing is our best choice. Underneath, got George Byers as two and a half. I mean, his form's okay. Said I'll drop him. Canberra is my DRLF. Try him. That's what I rested in my last game. Okay, happy with that. Let's go. Oh, here we go. Key highlight. We've got the ball. Playing some nice football, I must admit. Very confident. 
Slick, gone. Johnson, Canberry. Canberry turns. Ah, oh, is that a goal? Or is that offside? It's a goal. Oh, he is offside. I had a feeling. Nah. Is it? Nah. Hmm. I think we got robbed there. If we go on to lose this. And this is where they get for goal. Oh, cleared off the line. Nil nil half time. Yeah, very tight game. Very tight game. Good ball out to a wing. Early cross. Oh, great goal. There you go. That's that early cross. Hit early cross. Patterson. Lovely. Yeah, so he's knackered. Hunt on. Easy swamp. We won't go defensive. Do that last 10 minutes or so. Believe that we've we've got for front foot up for the moment. So I believe we could either get another goal. Patterson's a bit tired. And Gregory. That's why we got a squad. Hmm, that was a poor header down, Gregory. It's gonna open us up. Ah, oh, come on, someone tackle him. Hunt back to Gregory. Hunt. The one go. Wing. Canberry, it's got to be a goal, surely. Ah. Oh. Gregory. Let's see it out. So, Luongo. Canberry playing as a cam. Jay Dunkley for Sam Hutchinson. Looking for that direct pass. Set it nice. Go out wide. That's it. Wing. Oh, good run, Adrian. Oh, unlucky. And that's it. Win. Great away win. Look at that. 2 0. 2 0. Good stuff. Right, let's go. Chef Wednesday Sunderland in the league. We played them in the cup and beat them 2 0 at Sunderland. So let's see what we can do at home versus this team. Sunderland not doing that well at the moment. They're 13th in the league. It'd still be a good win if we get it because they've got a good little team. Oh, our key Canberry. Oh, that just hit a crossbar. So they are playing. Better than us. Okay, let's see if just maybe a, a talking to might kick him in gear. We haven't taken nearly enough shots on this way with that. We can still win this. Um, yeah, not getting enough shots away. And again, I don't want them to just be shooting for the sake of it now. There you go. Oh, four. Two on target. Got some shots on target. Five, two. Ah. They said, listen to me, 10 minutes and we more than doubled our shots. And at least we've got a couple on target now. Disappoint with Patson, disappoint with him and Gibson. Team's looking a little bit well, tired, aren't they? Hang on, Byers. Byers coming in might improve their performance. Lawongo's on a yellow card, 6.7. Yeah, who could we bring in now? I guess Hutchinson is a natural there. Right, free kick. Johnson. Yes. Che Dunkley. Oh, you can see them pressing. That's create a bit of space, Johnson. Oh, unlucky. Oh, now do we try and go defensive like what we did when we was 2 0 up? Where they bombarded us. It's a bit too soon yet. Ah, uh, oh, got to do it. I mean, it's been paying off for us getting defensive, right? Hasn't let us down. So, Canberry, Byers, Free Kick, Johnson. Can we? Yes. Patterson. He has not been playing great, but comes up for goods. 2 0 again in that defensive formation. Got to be game over. Just need to keep the ball, defend it. Don't give them any chance of getting in our box. We can do that. We will see out this game. Oh, you. What did I just say? Don't give them a chance in our box. Can't, it's got to be over now. Yeah. 
good win. It's twice now. Oh, that goal got overruled. Must have been offside. I missed it. It was too nift. Just realised 2 0. Third in for table. Look at that. Still Cholton and Wimbledon haven't lost a game yet. Seven games played. We're on 16 points. Won five, drawn one, lost one. Any shocks here? No. I think the biggest shock is Sunderland down on 16th. Patson out five to six weeks. Another big player. Look, I've got Bannon and Windass already out. Or you could put it down as big earners. But Patson's definitely performing for us. 7.46 in the league. 7.48. Cup 7.3. Had a great preseason. Played for six, scored five in the league, came off a sub in the cup and scored. That's a big loss because we like getting those balls in, early crosses, get his head in, and he's brave to get up there. And he's a team player as well, I like it. All right, Wednesday versus Shrewsbury. We are at home again. Uh, just a few changes. Uh, resting all for a wing, and obviously Patterson's out injured, but bringing in Gregory Byers and Hutchinson. I think it's just the way my team plays, really. On for a wire. Oh, good ball through. And he missed. Come on, that's for quality of their players. Let's show our quality now. Gregory Hunt. Canberry Hunt. Gregory. Oh, good block by their player. They're playing good football. Shrewsbury. Considering they're away from home. Maybe we need to pressure them a little bit. Again. Oh. Okay, well, we need to change something, so let's have a look. <clears throat> I don't think sh our shape's fine. I'm going to tweak that. It's um, out, of out of possession. We need to, yeah, a bit more tight marking. Yeah, I expect to see a better second half. All right, change. We are ready for changes. Not happy with us. We're at home and we're losing to Shrewsbury. Yes, they are fifth, but we're at home. Just go for it. I'm going to take off Hunt. Bring it on. So, Lewis Gibson's not playing great. And Adrian for Barina. How about that? Let's go for it. And today, we're losing. If we sit back and just continue and it's just have no chance right wasn't working for us great ball into johnson come on come on johnson your shooting is awful come on salvage a point keep that form good oh, is that a penalty buyers to take penalty come on yes well deserved Just keep them on front foot keep them going Keeps tactic how it is. Last minute? No, that's it. A draw. Okay, I'm happy with that. Considering throughout pretty much 70th minute. So we're resting some players in this. We go through that in a second. Um, just a change of mentality, playing cautious. Just gonna see what it does to us being away. And we change for interim session. Instead of counter pressing, we're gonna regroup. So a bit more defensive. Uh, playing away. So four changes from last match. Uh, Wildsmith in for Peacock Farrell. Palmer in for Gibson. Johnson, uh, Brown in for Johnson and uh, Barino in for Luongo. Okay, so we're not playing that well again. Uh, got possession, just creating chances. Four, three, you could argue it's not bad. HG's not great. I think what I want to do is put that up to balance and put that as counter press. That's why I want to go back to what we were playing before. Crystal Rovers are enjoying themselves. Oh dear. They're having fun. I'm certainly not watching this game. 
it's raining, it's miserable, it's midweek fixture, it's a Carabao Cup. But again, it's an opportunity. It's an opportunity to get into a fourth round. Barino. Okay, maybe let's bring Canberra into the DRF because we know he can get a goal or two there. On a rest wing, uh, bring on So as a cam. Keep Gregory on, he's done okay. Jaden Brown again. Every time he plays, just to spy me, I don't think he likes that wing back. Considering he's attacking midfield wing back material, he doesn't do great there, does he? I don't have Johnson on for bench. Could put Palmer there and bring on Iolfa. Hard team to get conceded against, so Palmer can bury Byers. He's got a shot on him, hasn't he? There that, what a goal. It's two from him now, that from that range. That was better though, because it lifted up. He had for gap. He was getting closed down and just bang it. It looked like a toe poke. So, our oh, great chip over. A uh, bit too far for Gregory, but great ball back in, and that's a penalty. Kimberly gets pushed over. I will make another sub. Byers. Two for Byers. He needs a rest. Dunkley. Yeah, that's fine. Graham Gibson. If we goal change the game. Yeah, look. Yeah, even if HG tells me that, look. It's getting better and better. Nearly getting there. Playing good football. We were just rubbish. I was... If we didn't get a goal around that time, I was going to put my attacking formation in. Thank you for watching this video. If you enjoyed it, please leave a like. If you would like to watch more videos like this, please subscribe. And to be notified, click on the bell.